Hello and welcome to IFL Securities YouTube channel. I am Shweta Papriwal and today we have Mr. Ram Ajarappu, Promoter and CEO of Decipher Labs Limited. Welcome sir, it's a pleasure to host you today. Likewise, thank you so much for having me. So sir, to start with, uh, we would like to know what uh, are the company's products and services that the company offers? Yeah, we have been offering, uh, uh, historically the company has been uh, in pharmaceutical, though we do have an IT subsidiary, um, you know, uh, it didn't really take off, but the group has been uh, having a great experience in the IT industry. And uh, we are able to leverage our experience uh, lately and we see a lot of prospects. In terms of services, uh, through an acquisition of an SAP Gold Partner, uh, two years ago, we have been offering uh, SAP uh, consulting services uh, for our uh, U.S. customers. Uh, so, sir, uh, I mean, we would also like to know who are your current clients? Yeah, uh, we do have uh, several customers just on top of my head, uh, just to name few, Merck, Allergan, uh, SAP, uh, Assurance, IBM, Corazon, uh, Railing, uh, just to name few. And uh, how, what is the company's geographical footprint in India as well as, you know, overseas? Yes, uh, we do have few clients uh, in India, but uh, majority of them are uh, based in U.S. Right. Uh, just to give my background, has been in U.S. for uh, the last 26 years. Um, by birth, I'm an Indian, but I relocated here 26 years ago. So my experience mostly has been uh, in U.S. Okay, so you have been associated with the company for how long? Uh, in 2017, through uh, an acquisition of, uh, you know, through an open offer, I did uh, uh, acquire majority of this company uh, from uh, the promoters of combat uh, drugs. Um, and then uh, followed, followed by that, uh, I identified, negotiated and acquired this SAP gold partner company located in Florida. And then we reverse merged that. Uh, I mean, I acquired that and then uh, changed the company name to Decipher Labs Limited. All right. So also, sir, like you mentioned about your, you know, IT subsidiary. And so the latest BSC, you know, release, we, what we've gone through, you have announced that, you know, the plans to foray into the IT sector. If you could elaborate on that. Yeah, as uh, you can see, the world has been moving uh, fast with uh, you know, because of this COVID and various other variants, um, every company is adopting digital strategy, moving into cloud. So our focus is going to be, um, you know, both organic growth and as well as through acquisitions. Uh, we will definitely look at, uh, you know, there are uh, several discussions and types going on um, to acquire cloud space, augmented reality, um, uh, so I do see uh, bright prospects for the company uh, going forward. Uh, you know, if everything goes well as planned, I do see we'll be able to close another acquisition before end of this uh, fiscal year. Yes. So, so if you could brief us about the you know results for the last two quarters, uh, which have you know already shown overall growth. Yeah, yeah. In fact, uh, you, you may be only focusing on last two quarters, but if you see, uh, we have been growing last two years. Um, you know, just last year alone, we have grown over right. hundred percent, uh, meaning we have doubled our revenue. Uh, only people started paying attention now, but we have been growing for the last two years. Right. And I do see, uh, you know, uh, our profitability also has uh, uh, jumped up and uh, uh, we have not, uh, in my opinion, we have not reached the full potential uh, yet. We uh, just achieved 14 crores that translates to around uh, 1.48 EPS, but uh, um, we have not uh, reached the full potential yet. There's a lot of uh, uh, things in the pipeline and uh, people started, uh, you know, with this vaccinations, uh, 
uh, or uh, above 50%. Uh, now that people started uh, resuming uh, to the offices, so I see uh, this is going to be a tremendous uh, growth opportunities going forward. So in terms of numbers, I mean, what are you expecting for the next quarter and as well as, you know, the entire financial year, FI22? Yeah, um, as you must have seen um, in the FI21, we have uh, achieved 56 crores uh, turnover. Uh, and I do see, uh, based on the negotiations going on, if everything goes well as planned, I, I do see we'll be able to uh, you know, add another 20 million uh, through that acquisition target, uh, which we are hoping to close uh, in FI22, uh, hopefully with a margin of 10, 15 percent um, in you know, EBITDA margin. So that would uh, definitely put us uh, you know, over 100 crore uh, turnover. That's what uh, we are looking at. So, sir, I mean, uh, who are your peers and how well are you placed vis-a-vis -vis your peers? Um, again, uh, the, the peers are, as you know, IT industry is, uh, you know, worldwide. Uh, uh, there's a lot of them, actually, uh, in terms of peers, you know. Um, uh, but uh, there are few... Uh, with the kind of experience the group has, we have, you know, in, in US market and uh, especially in the uh, cloud, AI, and augmented reality, this is uh, where our focus is going to be. Um, and with the experience I have, uh, you know, uh, I have over 25 years experience in, uh, you know, uh, IT, uh, pharma and energy sectors in one of the companies that uh, I founded, it is, uh, you know, a lot of them are super successful. One of them is is today trading uh, on NASDAQ with over a half a billion dollar market cap. Um, uh, the, the symbol is AMTX on NASDAQ. So that was founded by me um, almost uh, uh, 13 years ago. So we have a tremendous experience and background uh, in, in, in mergers and acquisitions. So I see we will be definitely acquiring a company or two in the next uh, uh, one or two years in the cloud or uh, AI space. Right. So as you've mentioned that, you know, the company is very well placed and, you know, is on the growth trajectory. So what message would you want to convey to your shareholders? So I take this opportunity to thank all our shareholders uh, to be patient with us and uh, uh, standing by. And I remain committed uh, to deliver exceptional results uh, going forward. And, uh, you know, if everything goes well uh, as planned, uh, especially with that vision, I'm excited uh, at the prospects of uh, announcing a healthy uh, dividend uh, by next year. So thank you so much, Mr. Ajarapu, for taking the time out and briefing us about the company and your growth plans. We wish you and the company all the best. Thank you, sir. Great. Thank you so much for having me. Really appreciate it.